In this tutorial, we'll take a look briefly at the insert string function in eForms. Let's say you wanted to add a character or string of characters at a certain location in a variable. Well, to do that, you can use the insert string function in the eForms composer. In this example, we'll add a number sign or pound sign or hashtag in front of this order number right here. And to do that, we'll just go to our order number variable over here in our project window, right-click the order number, select Add Function, and Insert String. And at character position 0 is the first place of the string, the first where the string begins. It begins at 0. And we'll just add our number sign right there, and select OK. And there it is. We have our number sign in front of the order number and we can see it here since we've already placed it and over here in the variable window we see the number sign as well if I wanted to put an extra space in between them I can right click my edit string and select edit and add a space after the number sign and select OK again and that gives me an extra space there so it's adding the number sign in a space at position 0 and it takes up two spots and then it begins with the order number. So that is briefly how you insert a string in eForms.